Hello and welcome to this AV Converter tutorial. Uh, first, a little bit of background. AV Converter is a uh, free open source video conversion tool provided by uh, Libav. Um, it's the successor to FFmpeg, so if you've used FFmpeg, you should be uh, pretty familiar with the uh, syntax and usage of AV Converter. Um, so for the first tutorial, we'll have a look at a bit of um, raw HD footage and um, using AV Converter to uh, uh, convert it into something more manageable. Uh, so here's some raw HD footage I recorded earlier. Uh, yeah. Okay, so um, if we go into a terminal here, well, I'm just in terminal here, and uh, we uh, change directory to the desktop because that's where I have the movie stored. So um, first of all, you'll need um, you'll need libav installed, and you'll also need um, yasm, which is a uh, just an extension, and a um, the libx264 codec and the libvorbis codec for this tutorial. Uh, abconv every command starts off with that, and then dash i denotes the input. So our input is input.mov, the raw HD footage. And then um, we'll specify the codec for the video stream. So C for codec, B for video. And then we'll use the uh, libx264 codec. Uh, and then specify the bit rate um, for 4,000 kilobits per second, or uh, you could just put 4 megabits per second. And then um, the first time around, we'll use uh, one of the uh, X264 presets. So um, I'll use the slow preset. Uh, in general, it's better to just use as slow as you can bear. And this is only six seconds long. So uh, I mean, I can even use a slower preset. Yeah. But it, um, it's really up to you. The, the slower you go, the better quality you get. But it takes a lot longer. Um, and we'll use. Uh, the film tune, uh, the tune just um, changes some of the uh, settings of the codec according to what kind of stuff you have. So you can have a film, you can have animation, or there's grain, there's still image, but I'll just uh, I'll use the film tune. And um, then there's a uh, the codec for the audio, which we'll be using uh, with Vorbis. Uh, Vorbis is just a uh, open source codec for the audio, it's lossy, but it brings the bit rate down. And we can use a, uh, the bit rate for the, sorry, bit rate for the, for the audio, um, 1 to 8, okay. And then the last thing you put is just the uh, output. I'll make mine a uh, Matroska file. Okay, so uh, this is going to take uh, some time because we've used a slower preset, so I'll uh, come back when it's done. Um, okay, so we're uh, back. That encode took uh, quite a long time, even though it was just six seconds. And uh, we can see we have an uh, output file here, across the file. Which, um, which is our video, and it's uh, this one was... 5.7 megabytes, the original was 8 megabytes, so it's a little bit reduced in size, but um, we have kept quite high quality with the presets. Okay, I'm going to try one now uh, without the presets. Okay, so we start with the avconv command again, and then a dash i to denote input, same input, input.mov, and then a uh, dash c for codec and using the same codec for the video same uh, bit rate of uh, four, four, bit, uh, 4 megabytes per second 4 megabits per second sorry and then the uh, dash c codec for audio uh, same loop vorbis and the uh, same bit rate for the audio but this time with no presets at all for the uh, video and uh, in a uh, AV convert, we can also denote size with um, dash s. We can either put um, the dimensions as in uh, 1920 by 1080, or uh, we can simply put HD 1080, or uh, we can put 720. I think we'll try 720 this time. 
and then I'll just output Matroska file. Okay, so we'll uh, see you when the encode has uh, finished. Okay, uh, so that's now done. Um, it took about a minute. And uh, we have our no preset output now here, which is only 2.9 megabytes, even, although bear in mind it is only 720p. And uh, the quality might be a little bit reduced. Um, you can see in some of the frames that a, uh, it's a little bit blurry, but depending on your needs, you can choose the different presets depending on how long you have, how long your video is. So, um, yeah, that was the uh, using the H.264 codec for the video and the, the Libvorbus codec for the audio, uh, dealing with some raw HD footage using the AV converter.